few days ago we accidentally rescued two strike cats right from our street. This kitten was locked in the cage to bait and catch his mother or this young pregnant madam. My name is Paul, welcome to the Caterkey channel. We are slowly approaching the launch of Cat Cafe and Rescue in Vietnam. Quick updates on our progress before I give you the exciting details of rescuing these cats. For the last few months we have been looking for a house suitable to our cafe. I mean, um, cats and people living space, cafe space, room for a kitchen, etc. We need all of that, not expensive, and uh, located somewhere not so far from the central district of the city. We visited more than 20 houses and found about 5 suitable ones. One of them even had a sea view, but each deal fell through just before the signing of the contract. And every time for a ridiculous reason. For example, a sea view house turned out to be non-existent in a legal sense. According to the papers, its landlord owns an empty mountainside. Another one suddenly changed their mind about renting out the house for business, and so on. The last landlord tried to hide the fact that she isn't the owner and was trying to sublease the house to us with an iffy future. Well, no one thought it would be easy. Back to the cats. This is the kitten we feed on our street. And this is the trap cage one of our neighbors used to catch cats with the intent to sell them for meat. I don't think they eat them directly, it's just a way to get something in the family budget. The design of the trap is simple, the cage has a small compartment for the bait. In this section the poor kitten was locked up. I have seen other hunters more often use birds for this. So the kitten screams inside and adult mother cat enters the large compartment and the trap closes. We began to call the neighbors on our microscopic Vietnamese street and they quickly understood what was happening. After a long knock in the gate we were let inside. My brave partner Olga pulled the kitten out and I crushed the cage with my foot. And it was my mistake. After that it was only thanks to the support of our wonderful neighbors who swarmed around that fight was avoided. And even the owners of the house were involved in subsequent negotiations to resolve this conflict. So, finally, we were forced to buy a new cage, which is consistent with human right to own property, even if it's a bloody cage trap. In any case, it was a rewarding experience. I am also referring to the experience of all observers who have seen our reaction to this whole situation. But the main reward is, of course, two wonderful cats that have already become part of our pride. As you probably noticed, the bobtail cat is um, slightly pregnant. Therefore, we now definitely have no way back with the opening of a cat cafe. Become our patron and hit the like button because we need your help to launch our project in Vietnam. Thanks for watching.